Hello everyone. Welcome back to Code King. In this series, I'm going to start with an application that is journal application. In this series, we will develop an application that is fully functional by using backend as a firebase. So let's see how it application work and what is the purpose of its application. So basically, this is the splash screen of the application. And the name of the application will be my journal. So it's a main screen. From here, user can navigate to the login and sign up page. Now, if user is already logged in, then he can put the details and move further. Otherwise, sign up here. Now, it needs only your username, email and password to create a new account. Sign up here, wait for So this is your all journal screen in which uh, here we have not added any journal yet. So basically journal is something if you want to save any thought or memories like any situations then you can save it here. So for that add journal click on the plus button. Now it's your username and it's your current date. Now here you can add a title and a thought. So we can also save an image with it. So let's see how we can add. Click on it. Choose any of image. And give it an title. Write your thoughts. and add journal now this is it here your journal comes so it's your title and it is your thought so it is a time ago means how much time ago you have uploaded this journal and it's your current date on the date which you have put it So let's go to the backend that is Firebase. We have used in it a Cloud Firestore. So here we will go to authentication. Here the users is authenticated. Now let's go back to the storage now in it we learn how we can upload images in the firebase and how we can fetch it so this is here image you have uploaded now go to the cloud fire store where all the data has been saved so now here it's all users data that contain user id and username where in the user journal it is having all the details like your current date image url thoughts title user id username let's try to log out from here now try to log in again with your credentials
so we can see here our journal is present here now let's add one more guys we can also delete our journal in case if you want to delete it then there is a button with the help of that you can delete your journal also from your database so let's see how we can if I delete second one then you will see that the from the firebase it is also deleted Let's delete another and see the changes. So let's see guys. I hope you will like it. I will see you next video. We will develop its full application in upcoming videos. Thank you.